This morning, there is still tension between students and school officials in Edina over the district's dress code. Some students say it's unfair and too strict. A protest broke out in the hallways of Edina High School yesterday, but district officials say students have nothing to be upset about because the dress code hasn't changed. Mary McGuire is in the newsroom with how school officials plan to move forward. Well, Kim, the students we spoke with say the dress code enforcement changes began when a new principal started at Edina High School, but he insists those changes are just rumors. The protest may have been sparked by two incidents since last week regarding students wearing what administrators felt were revealing shirts. On Thursday, students filled the commons of the high school chanting and speaking out against a dress code that creates standards they believe are too strict and unfairly targets females. We spoke with one senior at the high school who took part in that demonstration. Last year we had other problems with our community and it was like more about race and everything and like now it's about sex versus sex and it's just like can we just like come together as a whole and just accept people for who they are like you guys say you are and it's just like it's just a lot of lies. Now the current dress code at Edina High does bar skimpy tank tops and short shorts or what could be reasonably construed as sexual. Still the principal insists rumors that the school is banning things like skinny jeans and leggings are all false. Now here in the state of Minnesota Kim each individual public school district sets their own dress code and obviously it's up to them to enforce it how they choose to. All right, so what are the plans for the school next? Well, the principal at Edina High says students decided to protest while he was meeting with student leaders about that dress code rumor. Going forward, administrators will meet with students to discuss their concern. The big one that we're hearing is that it unfairly targets those female students when it comes to what they wear to school. Yeah, it sounds like it. All right, Mary, thank you.